Here's a couple catch wrestling tricks that I'd like to show you from the guard. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to crank his neck. And when I crank his neck, I'm gonna to try to get a tap. But if I don't from the can opener, what's gonna happen is he's gonna open his legs. When he opens his legs, it's gonna give me a couple options. Number one is I'm gonna lay back and heel hook him. And the second thing I'm going to do is I'm gonna pass his guard. And then I'll add one more. I'm gonna run over him and hit an STF. Step over toe hold face lock. I'll bring in my assistant, Peter Lee Thomas. All right, here we go. He's on his back. So, he's got a closed guard on me. So the first thing I do is, is I block and I come up and I'm gonna grab the top crown of his head here. And as I'm doing that, I'm gonna start to turn his head and I'm gonna start to pry my elbows using my elbow points here. And I'm gonna just start dropping and twisting and trying to get the neck crank. So what's gonna happen is he is going to open his legs to, to defend. So the whole objective with this, with this neck crank is, some people try to get a submission here, you can, but it's also used just to open the legs. So you're gonna block, you're gonna come up to here, and you're gonna pull, see how his feet, now look at how my foot comes under, and then as it goes under, I'm just gonna slide right back to the heel hook. And the heel hook is super fast. And I'm, I'm using bone on bone, and I'm putting my body weight and pulling it into my face. So again, when I start to do the pry, he opens. Look how fast from here. Look at my foot, how it windshield wipers underneath. And as I'm sitting back, I hook the leg so he can't pull his knee line out. Then my leg stomps over. I reach back, and this is the toe hold, but it's actually a heel hook. And I, you can see how I'm bearing down and pulling the heel to my face. Okay. Number one is the heel hook. Number two is the guard pass. So I go like this, boom. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reach under, just like this, and he could try to do, uh, a lot of people say, oh, he'll get the triangle. Go ahead, triangle me. Yeah. You hold their head and their leg together like this. And you put all your body weight down. And then we use it as a pass. And then when I get the pass, look at it. Look what I got right in front of me. So I go like this. Mmm, that looks tasty. So I go from right here, boom, and step. And then finish the toe hold right here. One more time. So I go here, huck, immediately reach under, put all my body weight forward and down. Look at that foot. Best time. Put it on the floor, step over, and then slowly fall and roll and let your toe hold. Okay, number three. Third thing. Uh, this one. This one, uh, all you gotta do is you gotta get up on your hands and feet. So I go here, boom. So all I'm gonna do is get here, and his, he's gonna keep his legs, he's not gonna put his feet on the ground, he's just gonna open his feet. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna come up, and I'm gonna just slowly crawl over him and hold his knee, and sit to the hip lock, to the Achilles lock, hold, Watch this, come on over here, twist, and STF. So I'm gonna come here, boom, and then I'm gonna put my hands here and pop up to my feet. And as I do this, I'm gonna slowly run over his shoulder, and I wanna hook his leg. So when I land, look at I'm already at a hip, this is the hip lock. Then I could go for an Achilles lock. If I wanted to, I could even go for a heel hook. You catch it here, you twist. This is the cross face and the STF, using the leg as a clutch, pulling his head. Then abandoning this and grabbing the arm and going to the walkie katami. Reverse straight arm bar. Okay. 